What's the matter? Seems like uh, whenever anything good in my life happens, I'm just afraid I'm going to lose it. I really love you. Molly? Molly, you in danger, girl. Demi Moore is Marina, a girl who dreamed she was about to meet the love of her life. But it was Leo Lemke who washed up on her beach and took her to a romantic island far, far away. Leo! Hey, Doc! Me, Marina! Um, how much are these? Those are 350. This is three. There you go. Thank you. There's a lot of nuts in this city. You don't want people thinking you're one of them. Marina has always made predictions. I need veal chops. Lots of them now. And she's usually right. What's this? Veal chops, lots of them now. Wow. Especially when it comes to romance. There's love waiting for you behind a friendly face. Oh, I ever know for sure. I dreamed about it. How come you told her all that uh, stuff? Do you really think she's clairvoyant? Can't help what I see. You might want to be careful about ordering your life on such a primitive instinct. But love is about to take her completely by surprise. Because when it comes to the man of her dreams, she's off by half a block. Ah! Trim, I saw you in my dreams tonight. Oh, well, that's not uncommon. What was I doing? Smiling. She told me I was the man of her dreams. Maybe it's just not meant to be. I can't deny that I feel an attraction for you, but don't worry. Love is a leap that won't be denied. She's lonely tunes. She's wonderful. She's incredible. I understand what you're doing. It's good, because it makes it so much simpler. Demi Moore, Jeff Daniels, George Sunza, Mary Steenburgen. I've never met anyone quite like you. The Butcher's Wife. Well, you ought to get out more. Somewhere on the Mexican Riviera, a beautiful heiress has been kidnapped. To find her, they'll need the best team in the business. He has the experience, but his regular partner wasn't available. So they found someone even more lethal to himself. Ow! Oh, if you send somebody after her who's as unlucky as she is, he could literally stumble onto her. Oh, this is some kind of joke or something. At the age of three, he's almost strangled by the cord from some draperies. Mr. Proctor is here, sir. Oh. I want you to go to Mexico and look for my daughter. This man has been hit by lightning twice. Once while inside a movie theater. I think we're going to make a good team. Ow! I am trained in martial arts. Ah! Oh! Only you. It can only happen to you. You're jealous because women are attracted to me and you can't stand it. Stay still. No, go! Ah! Martin Short. It's a bee. Don't move. What? I'm allergic to bee stings. Danny Glover. Are you all right? Fine. And you? Pure luck.
Why are we out here tonight, Flipper? All right, you gotta promise me that you're not gonna tell anyone. My lips are sealed. Come on, what happened? All right, but you gotta swear. I mean, this is like swearing a stack of Bibles, swearing like a zillion rosary beads. I, I swear on my great-grandmother, okay? We swear, we swear, what? I, I cheated on Drew. I'm saying somebody. You too, Tyra? Who are you saying? Oh. I thought you were gonna drop a bomb. I... And what is he, like, blonde, blue-eyed surfer type? Hey, dude. Right? <laughs> She's white. White! Man, are you... Hey, Willie's black. If your father ever found out, I don't know. She's Italian. H-bomb. From Bensonhurst. Nuclear megaton bomb. Hey, look, this is the 90s. There's nothing wrong with it, you know? The both of you's got jungle fever. The both of you. Out of your home. Will you listen to me? Like Jonah was cast out of the belly of the whale. You had to eventually go get yourself a white girl, didn't you? What do you mean eventually? What a tramp. What a slut. Do you know there's only one thing he could possibly want from her? You're gonna give her a beating? My ah! father did that already. It don't even matter what color she is. My man is gone. <laughs> Why don't you pull the car over, pal? I mean, I, I don't want any trouble, you know? I promise. Just pull it over. From director Spike Lee. Welcome to the Taj Mahal. Eighth wonder of the world. Gator Mama wants to know where the TV is. It's right here. Me and Viv smoking the color TV. Jungle Fever. Wesley Snipes. Annabella Shiora. Spike Lee. Ossie Davis. Ruby D. Samuel L. Jackson. Lynette McKee. John Turturro. Frank Vincent and Anthony Quinn. We got a big problem. You and her. Original songs by Stevie Wonder. Danny and Bert have been dreaming about this trip for years. She looks like Uncle Charlie just said she's gorgeous. You know, gorgeous like Marilyn Monroe or gorgeous like Jane Russell. Bert, she's the best in the world. They've been saving up to buy themselves something special. Lola. We know that you probably charge a lot, but maybe you could just figure it by the minute. You know, like a, a parking meter. But things have changed. I have news for you. I quit. Sure she's saying no now. She'll change her tune. You watch. Where are you going? Bedroom. Really? Really? Left my gun up there. Three minutes work for her has turned into three weeks work for them. It's not gonna take me three weeks to get in her pain. Well, I'm gonna get her first. Sex is still an important part of her job. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at me go. But not the kind of sex they had in mind. People pay me to breathe their mares to him. I mean, he does it for money, too, huh? You think she's hot for him? He looks like Paul Newman, and he's as rich as God. Why would she be hot for him? They thought she would change their lives. When I heard about you, I figured that was it. But when her past caught up with her... That woman sure reminds me of somebody. 
Their jealousy changed her life forever. Why don't you ask your buddy Wally whether she was a hooker or not? You bastard! He was one of her customers. What do you suppose love means to a woman like that? A summer journey into adulthood with the last prostitute. Only trouble is, gee whiz, I'm dreaming my life. incarceration saves an estimated 1.5 billion dollars per year while solving the problem of prison overcrowding and cruel conditions the more things change the more they stay the same a complex criminal conspiracy is uncovered in the city of the future the whole fabric of society is at risk I'll do him too, so I'll be good! Well, first you ban capital punishment, then you ban handguns from everyone, including your own police. We need help, Russ. We need help. Kit's back in a new century and a brand new adventure. Switch to virtual reality. With the latest technology and an old friend. Is that you, Michael? Yeah. You look like crap. Well, so do you, pals. Now it's time for a new partner. Michael, kindly tell this obnoxious person to remove her hands from my wheels. If she has your missing chip implanted in her brain. We'll simply have to have it removed. David Hasselhoff and Edward Mulhair return. One man can make a difference. With the car with an attitude. Prepare for a collision. Night Rider 2000, exclusively on CIC Video. There's nothing worse than a smart ass automobile. Wife. Mother, murderer. This is the incredible true story of Marie Hilly. We've got a laundry list of slowly accumulating violence here. The only monthly payment she's made good on is her daughter's life insurance policy. No, no. Maybe this will help. What's been happening ever since Daddy died? Do you think my mama's crazy? She's on the run. People on the run look over their shoulder a lot. She's going to make a mistake. This kid is full of arsenic. You have to help. She's my mama! The Marie Hilly Story, on video. Every woman wants someone to watch over her. You can see everything that's going on down there, can't you? Someone to share her feelings. You're a true romantic, just like me. Someone to care. Everything I did was to get close to you. Unless that someone... Why are you doing this to me? ...is this man. It wasn't supposed to turn out like this. There are relationships made in heaven. I don't want to lose you, Hill. And others... I killed right now. ...that are one... Leave me alone! ...holy... Hurting him doesn't stop him. ...living... Don't leave me, Hillary. ...hell. I care about you more than anything on this earth. I care about you more than my own life. <laughs> what if I said I wouldn't let you go? No matter what you did. Lower level. What do you want? Drinks. A little conversation. 
Whatever. The last place on Earth you want to go on a date.